acapella freestyle, man. Yeah, just give the people what they want. Yeah, sitting at a big table. It's looking good. I'm repped up east side. That's my damn hood. The barrio. I say sorry, bro. They be coming at me. I'm like, where's my boy Harvey, ho? Now I come in at the door, slamming the dang. I'ma come, I'ma take a motherfucking panky ring, put it in my pocket. I got a hot pocket too, a socket. Yeah, now I'm gonna have to rock it like the shit in the sky. Uh. NWO on the chest till I die. Nick sat down, I heard him fucking fart. He better not deny that was a form of art. It was so good and it's stinking up my nose. Now I'm sitting in the growler pod chilling with my bros. Oh, where is I 100% didn't fart, but... Oh, he told oh, you he did not. I told to you. I fucking said he'd do it. But, oh. but, Everybody's I do got one in the chamber. One in the chamber. <laughs> that shit stay loaded, though. Dude, one in the chamber? I mean, who, who doesn't have one in the chamber at all times? You know what I'm saying? Mm. Dude... Y'all guys got you guys got one. You're living a dangerous I'm, life right I now. I got one in the chamber. I feel like if so I fucking good. try to force, no, nah, I don't. Right now, I'll take a shit. I don't hang out with one in the chamber. If I have one in the chamber, I try to squeeze it out nice and slow. If I'm in somewhere where I can't, like, <laughs> if I can't let it rip, yeah. I if you got one in the chamber, you gotta let that shit sink down there, or else you're gonna shart. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Well, and we're starting off strong. He ain't wrong though, cause Man. like, dude, I, there are, there are, about consistency, baby. Shitty. There are some motherfuckers though that can just like fart on command. <laughs> <laughs> like I swear, man, on there's command, like, there's just fools that just be out here farting. I, like I've like they never I mean, said I could it, burp they just on did command, it. But yeah, that too. Yeah, that's easy. People can do that shit too. I'm like, what you can't fuck? burp on command. No. Yeah, you just go. It's just like air, like pushing air out of your yeah, mouth. Yeah, you just gather the fucking. I I remember this kid when I was like I don't know fucking nine or ten. I saw him do it. You remember when the what, fucking first time fart? There was uh, what what were we just talking? About? The fucking on call fucking burping. This kid did this shit, but the same kid. You remember when you used to like have those little, little beaded fucking designs? They were like lizards and shit. Oh yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, with yeah. the different colored beads, that what kid would called? also make those beads, but he could also burp on command. Well, they they used to have a stupid maker. fucking story to start the they podcast. Used, well, they used to have back in the day they had burping contests and they had people that could burp their ABCs. Yeah, and I've it'd be like seen uh, that shit. It, uh, but the burping contest, they'd drink a shitload of Mountain Dew and just go, and it'd be like sh- shake the fucking room loud. Mountain Dew specifically, Mountain Dew pop. Bro, Mountain Dew is the Mountain Dew is the. Do you just call it pop? pop? What are you from fucking Chicago? Mountain Dew pop. Some pop. Uh, Some pop. Eh? They would from put fucking it, Wisconsin. They'd, they'd, from put, the they'd put it in the bag. The bag. The fucking pop. Wow. They would put pop. it in the bag and they would bring it up. My fucking grandma from Chicago calls it pop. Dude. It's like, oh, you want a pop? <laughs> I called it pop on purpose. Yeah, pop. Uh, I think you're just trying to cover your tracks, but we'll let you slide. It's all good, man. Since we're buds. Only way to... Since we've known you for 72 weeks, we'll let you slide, dude. 72 weeks, man. What is that? Over like a year and a half? I don't know. So, oh, yeah, because we sta- yeah, we met each other when we started this podcast. We don't yeah, hang we, out. We met each other episode <laughs> one 72 weeks ago. We don't hang out. We don't stay. Yeah. <laughs> we're, not, we're not friends whatsoever. Do you see how, how long it took me to fucking gather your logic? because my brain scrambled right now, man. We met, we met Devin fucking six weeks ago. Yeah. Yeah, I had to send my resume in. <laughs> yeah. We don't hang up. Yeah. He sent his resume to thegrowlerpod at gmail.com. I, I auditioned. And uh, he sent, yeah, I mean, and here he, he had is, his, dude. He had his casting couch audition with all of us. Yeah. yeah. He, he passed the dominance on flawlessly me. down there in the fucking dark corner of the studio. It's a nice couch. Basically, yeah, we dude. basically we just ran a train on him. <laughs> <laughs> no big deal. It's part, no of, the, deal, it's part of the gig. I mean, Danny was there before, so, you know. Danny yeah, couldn't handle it, man. He send your resumes. It. It broke. You know, that's all we're saying. Send your fucking resumes to growlerpod at gmail.com. Yeah. Jesse at thegrowlerpod.com. <sighs> yeah, we, right. need, uh, we actually do need growler emails. Yeah, we need, those real, we need those real emails, dude. Uh, Josh Ray at. I mean, we have growlerpod. thegrowlerpod.com. We could just fucking make real emails. I'd be fucking Josh sick. Ray at Speaking of, just, hit up thegrowlerpod.com, everybody. You could just stream from thegrowlerpod.com, too. Could we? I just got to figure that shit. Yeah, it's like a that. plug-in. That'd or be something. cool. Like a TV plug-in. Damn. I think it'd be that'd be cool. Like once we get like real big, where we're then we like do our own platform. That way oh. they can like go and click our merch tab or something while they're watching or whatever. Oh yeah, we also need to do merch. We got a lot to do. 
We're only fucking 72 weeks in. We got I mean, yeah, my a Growler Pod shirt. I forgot about it. You do? We're still fresh. One, one, of, it's just, one of one, baby. I don't know where it's at. Well, <laughs> every weekend I want to go to like the lake or go to the pool right now, so it's kind of hard in the summer. To, yeah. Like, it's go, hard all the, the time because, because the lake, you know tomorrow. what I want to do during the fall? Watch football. That's true, too. Yeah, now we want to watch sports because we just <laughs> yeah. started again. Yeah, so basically, basically there's no more merch, so. Don't yeah, when football's on, Josh it's like has we're all maniacs. Shirt. I guess Josh could put uh, the fucking shirt on eBay for 100 bucks. or something. Growler shirt? Yeah. You have a growler one. shirt? One of one. It's like... Yeah. He wore it like fucking three weeks ago. Fuck, I don't remember. $1,000. <laughs> also, a, anyone out there, if you want to buy the growler pod, 10 Gs will sell it. It's literally one yeah, of one. Yeah, no, 100%. 10 Gs. <laughs> 10 Gs, we'll just fucking rename the podcast. <laughs> yeah, we'll call it the growler pod 2. All right. The, hey, Mimi, I don't the know Growler podcast. Here. Oh, Mimi shouldn't be down here. <laughs> <laughs> she's she's, a hole she's the now. fucking worst down here. No, there's, I mean, I covered up all the holes, but the she's Mimi about pod. to climb under the steps. There she goes. She, uh, she, she knows how to get out of the... She's smart. Cats are fucking smart. They It'd are. be cool if, she like... Open uh, the, she can open the door and all that? Yeah, she can straight up open the door and get out. She can open the door and get in, too. Yeah, she's I know. Just sometimes when I'm Look over... When I, when I say that, when Please I stay get over, on the dude, table. I'll just hear the door fucking just open. I'm like, you scared her away, Josh. Damn it. Dude, cats are the weirdest little animals. They're just little murderers. My cat don't even. They are. Cat. My little, cat's fucking weird, man. Little fucking sociopath. Dude, they, they are the anti Fucking day. My cat oh yeah, dude. Like they just bring stuff. dead birds to your door and be like, <laughs> "What's up? I got this for you." Hey, look. Look at this present I brought yeah, you. They bite you. <laughs> when you're, you're like, dude, I don't want a fucking dead mouse. Dude, straight up last they night. They care about you, man. They're trying to feed you. I was walking to get my laundry out of the dryer. Mimi was fucking in front of me. And I guess I was getting too close to her. It pissed her off. She turned around. She's all <laughs> fucking like what? swiped at me. And I was just like, fuck you, dude. I'm just walking. And then like... <laughs> I got my laundry out of the dryer and I came around the corner and she was like hiding. She fucking like swiped at me again. I was like, fuck you, dude. dude little maniac. Like, I'm bro. not trying to fucking fight you. There you were just is. in my way while I was walking. What's up, Terry? Back up, Terry. We are good today. I'm good today. What up, Terry? We are, we are all good today. Long day at work. I showed up here with a fucking coffee. I mean, coffee. Don't, don't let them speak for me. I'm yeah, okay. This, this motherfucker came with a coffee, dude. I've never came with a coffee. I always show up with beer. This time I'm like, ah. You ever came in a coffee? I've, I've come with a coffee a couple times. I've never came in a coffee. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be really awkward. What if, like, I said it's that, though? My house you, and I've shown up. That's, 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 that's like, oh, as a matter of fact, like. <laughs> Yo, dude, I blow loads in all my coffees. That's why I'm so energized. <laughs> the placebo effect. It doesn't do shit for me, but I think it does. Dude, Jesus. that's the best drug there is. is that and, fucking placebo and effect. And gone. Dude, we're hitting so many of our bingos. Oh, fuck. We really, we really, we really got to make that card. I'll make it Placebo, tonight. the Spain, Spanish word for please. Blown loads. Two Taking please. dumps. Uh, I guess Mimi isn't really talking about the dogs, but I guess we could make it animals. Uh, oh, you want some chara? <laughs> What's the free one? Shit, shit. Oh, yeah. taking shit. taking dumps 100%. is fucking the free one. Balls. Yeah, and we came out hot with I that. I feel like we sh- we should just have one that says free. We should have one that says come. Yeah, well, Jesse said come already. already, already so come. I mean, right, we we, we hit a bunch of come. We we fucked up starting the stream. That should be one. Yeah, man. I think this Friday's just been a weird Friday, man. It's just like one of those <laughs> one of those neutral Fridays that really doesn't have anything going on with it, which is weird because this past six months have just been like a shit show. No, yeah, no, no joke. Really it's just have, been like we should have done a freaky. I mean, thing. there's a lot of shit going in the on in the world right now, but it's like it feels like everybody's just numb to everything right now. It's like every time I turn on the fucking TV, it's just fear porn. It's just like even no, or I go that? through Facebook, it's just fear porn. Well, it's just like everybody wants well, you to yeah. be as scared as you can fucking be of anything well, that's going on. First about, and like, foremost, porn. delete your Facebook, bro. Facebook's the worst. Yeah, I delete it all the time, and then I get back <laughs> on. Like I'll like I'll see he a girl, and I'm like, it. you can't delete. It. Huh? I'm gonna go see if she's you on Facebook. You can only deactivate it. That's it. That's fair. I'll like meet you a girl, delete, and I'm like, you can hmm, delete you know it, Facebook, but it doesn't baby? permanently delete it. Yeah, that's fair. It never lets you opt out. Entirely. And then and then I don't delete it, and then I'll be scrolling, and I'll see some fucked up shit, or just see like this world's so fucking stupid. And then I'll have to delete it again. And then. So yeah, you should, you, you should uh, have let, never you should let that affect it, though. You should just 
filter that shit out, bro. Yeah, like, you should Facebook just get is just for hometown people anyway. Though. So like, my own personal self, like, shit. I haven't been on Facebook since 2010, but maybe like three or four years ago, I started a burner Facebook specifically to look at like, because some restaurants are only on Facebook. Yeah, yeah. And I want to see like their specials or their menus. I started a burner Facebook. With a black square as my fucking picture. My name is fucking John Smith. I made a fake email, fake phone number, <laughs> everything, bro. And I swear to God, like fucking five minutes after I made it, my mom texted me and was like, is this you? It said Rick Beats, dude. That's yeah. Cool. And I was like. <laughs> Rick Beats. I was like, how the fuck, dude? I was like, yes, that's you didn't me. Have, and, you didn't have your phone number on it or anything? No, nothing. uh uh-huh. But it also said my name is Rick B. <laughs> yeah. But but the name I put on there was John Smith. Dude, it just knows. Dude, I've made a fake weird. account with John Smith too. That's weird that we both have done that. I mean, that's a that's the most common. It is. Fucking, it's like just the most. It's like John Jane Doe, whatever the fuck. Yeah. But like, it's like he, don't try to find John. me, you stupid motherfuckers. I don't use it. The space boy. Yeah. That's what John that's, Smith. That's what have you ever made a Pornhub account? Oh no! I no, I to the other day though. I think I, 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 have one. I think I have one. I've been really wanting it's to free. look into some of those. Bro, pre- every those time I get on videos. Pornhub, it's like Pornhub Premium's free. Is it yeah, always free now or what? It's I, free right now. It was just nah, just during the that. pandemic. It's well, you get always a, free. You get a week for free. Uh, I, every time I'm on there, uh, it's it free. No, nah, they just say that, dude. Because <laughs> whenever you click on it, they yeah, you know, they they'll give you your first. They probably want to charge you ten bucks or some shit. No, they'll give you your first week for free, and then they start charging. It's like you don't even need. It's like drugs. Premium is just for like the real like Hollywood production type. of... Yeah. See, I'm I'm into the real. Shit. The amateur, <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to, I'm trying to see a Hollywood fuck? fucking production, dude. dude. Amateur porn. I'm trying to see crazy. iPhone shit, like some real ass, oh, real, dude, you know real what? life scenario. Honestly, yeah, yeah, like like if you're in it, like if it's you. Yeah, dude. <laughs> like you know, I know that. Dude. <laughs> that seems, that, I mean, that seems fucking better. You know what dude, I'm saying? Fucking funny, or like man. it looks like it's, it's like someone fucking, and you could tell they're on Snapchat recording it. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I'm trying to see a horizontal shit, so you know it's fucking. Dude, I fucking bro. I fucking watched one. I watched one one time, and it's like they were like using them Snapchat filters. You know, the ones that like change your voice. And this chick was just straight getting fucked. This shit was just straight getting dick down. She's all like, ah, uh, ah. Uh. You know, like they like had that fucking voice. had that little like squeaky mouse voice on. Oh, there, that's dude. so weird. So she was just straight getting like straight dicked, dude, with like that fucking sounding like, like Donald Duck and shit. Yeah, like some Donald Duff, Duck over here smashing a pin cushion. Type Maybe shit. please come onto the table. It's funny story though, man. Fucking Dylan, shout out to my boy Dylan Holman. He he hit me up this morning and Chew said that bro. I was Chew the bro. first person that he ever watched porn with. Oh fuck yeah! I was dude. like, dude, I was like, hey, yeah. I was like, I was like, of course. It's a and coming of like, age I was, moment. I was like, we're at like at like my parents' house, and he was like, yeah, dude, we were at your parents' house one time. I don't even know how old we were. At even. your parents' house? Yeah, at my parents' house. Nice, and, like, dude. I think I watched one, watched my first one with like Jared. Dude, of yeah, I, I mean, Who I don't do know if it was mine, but it still probably was. like Adam or see your first born with, I guess. Adam Loxton. Do you remember that dude? Uh, who lived on the corner of Woodland down the street from Steven. His name was William. Can't fucking remember his last name. Mm-mm. He was out of his fucking mind. That was the first dude I ever fucking, like, saw porn with. He brought over some fucking, like, Playboys. Oh, I saw, like, porn magazines, like, when I was way younger. Yeah, yeah who who do you see Who do you see porn magazines with? With my first? cousin at my cousin's house. Because my cousin was, like, uh, two years older than me. So his dad had to, Actually, he might have been the first... One I saw a video with too, dude. And I was like man. sitting on the couch with a pillow over my dick. <laughs> it was all awkward. Oh, classic. Of yeah. course, dude. Dude, I fucking. And got I was it. just trying to sit there and act all cool, like, damn, this is tight. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, like, like cool. it's, you're not faced, but <laughs> yeah, dude, I fucking got ISS one time. At, I, I went to Bonham, dude, in like eighth grade. Like you back. I don't know ISS. why. I don't know why the fuck we did this shit in dude. school suspension. But like, y- you could take like the tongue or your shoe, not double tongue. But you could, like, take the tongue of your shoe, you know, and, like, put a little slit on the inside of it. And you could, like, yeah. it's like a little stash pocket. Yes, sir. And, like, yep. I don't... I iPath guess. made it a real hey, thing. I just said yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, iPath did make it a real thing. Well, anyway, I fucking had a bunch of, like, fucking, you know, like, fucking naked girl pictures up in one of those one day. Yo! And, like, you know, I was showing the boys <laughs> at... You know, like, I was, like, showing the boys at school, man. And, of course, in Amarillo, you can't... You can't say anything without everybody else knowing about it in five fucking <laughs> right. minutes. So, like... I guess somebody fucking snitched that I had fucking Damn, booby snitched, pictures in my shoe. They snitch on your porn, dude. Yeah, dude. That's like, fucked I, up. I gotta go to the office and they're like, "So we heard that you have like pornographic pictures in your shoe," and I'm like, "The fuck, no." <laughs> <laughs> I 
Like, nah. Did they search you? They searched my damn shoe and fucking found the little slit in there ah. and they just were pulling out. Like, I had probably had like 10, like, you know, like folded up little photos in there. Like, <laughs> wow. They knew, you know, they were all like folded, folded up too. So, like, the ink was all creased. Like, you could barely even see the pussy anymore. Like, all this shit, man. <laughs> it just looks like you got a picture Dude, of the damn sandwiches. Aerosmith. Yeah. I had Aerosmith t shirt all the time. Yeah. And I had a neon girl. It was a, it was a naked girl. It was like just a neon sign of a naked girl. And they had made me t- turn my shirt inside out. <laughs> Wasn't that the move, though? Like, if you're walking around with an inside-out shirt, like, everybody's like, dang, he's Wait, a that, bad kid. That must be a task. Wait, okay. That's, no, that's that, the fucking dumbest shit, no, I think it was at, like, Crockett or elementary school or something, but it was just a joke I'm because, never, like... I never knew that was a thing. It, 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 hadn't, it didn't have a nipple or anything. It was just a silhouette, and some girl was like, eh, and told on me, and I had it. I walked back, <laughs> and I was pissed. So I was like, bro, like, I went to an Aerosmith t- concert and, like, bought this, like... Yeah, you're trying to stun. What the fuck? Yeah, I was pissed. Well, dude, just being in like middle school, they were, they had the most stupid dress code rules. It was like the girls, their shorts had to be shorter than their their yeah, fingers. Their fingers yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah. like, that bitch has some long ass arms and fingers. Like, chill out. Like, yeah, her shorts got to go all the way down to her knees. I imagine that though, like John Jones fucking trying to wear some shit. <laughs> right, he's got to right. wear fucking jeans. Yeah, like they're they're, they're they kind of they kind of have their shoulders showing or something like. Yeah. Ain't nobody distracted by his shoulder, bro. Yeah, dude. Let me see some fucking. <laughs> yeah, like, I ain't over here ass. about to bust one. Under I'm my literally desk looking at shoulder. ass and titties. Yes, that's it. That's right, man. I could give a fuck about nowadays, your shoulders or your kneecaps. Nowadays they can wear I mean, like some, fucking yoga that, pants and shit. It's like that's, that's some, more revealing than anything. That's some sexy ass thighs, dude. Right you got to be but. some straight survivor on an island type shit for like a long time to be able to nut off to a fucking shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like sitting out there like some castaway nut type off. shit. Just looking at shoulders, like damn, fuck! Look at that like, fucking shoulder look at that, curve. Look at the ankle, man. Woo. Damn, she's got a curve on her shoulder. Look at them fucking collarbone indentions. God oh, damn. Oh, dude, yeah, I only last two seconds on the <laughs> collarbone, but dude, I'll be fucking on the collarbone <laughs> two seconds in. It's fucking <laughs> gravy, baby. Yeah, you like. That's like the fucking branch that the titties oh, hang off. Jesus of. fuck, we're fucking stupid. It is, dude. dude. All collarbone is a little titty tree. Yeah, that's true, man. <laughs> a little titty branch. tree. Titties just hanging off the collarbone. I mean, that's all it is. I saw some meme. I don't it, make the rules of science. It said that uh, nuts. <laughs> what the fuck did it? I'm going to butcher the shit. The butcher the fucking meme. Nuts or dick titties. <laughs> I think that's what it said. That's pretty, that's uh, pretty good. Yeah, fucking, they are, bro. I cracked up. That's that's funny, but do so. girls like I mean, nuts or dick titties? Do girls look at nuts and they're like, damn, those are no. some nice nuts. No, they don't. I ask every one of them. It just <laughs> depends. It depends on the type of girl, bro. I mean, uh, I'm, they, I'm they, sure there's fucking like, they say good like balls and bad balls, but yeah, balls are balls. It's I'm sure if you had a fucking weird looking dick s- sack there. on you, bro, they'd be like, damn. <laughs> yeah, if you're hanging sack. Yeah, yeah. dude, I'm hanging sack. <laughs> like, like my, yeah, you know, some melon nuts. That's yeah. like, like your thing, like full like, sack, bro. Like your sack's bigger than your dick. Like that's your move. <laughs> like, yeah, that's, yeah. that's your fucking play. When, it, when it's cold outside, you know, you never know. No, uh, yeah, you gotta check check in with them, you know. Right. Make sure my yeah, de- my we- weenie's still there. Your dick's all up in your ball sack like a turtleneck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, God damn it! Just weenie. looks like a baby sitting in a beanbag. Yeah, weenie, a weenie. He fucking says weenie and dookie every fucking. <laughs> yeah, man. When it's chilly outside, <laughs> those those are fucking. Those should be keywords on fucking bingo. Weenie and dookie. When it's chilly outside, it just looks like a newborn baby sitting on a beanbag, man. <laughs> Dude, I'd give it all right now for Shorty. That's what to my text wiener you looks say, like. Let me suck your weenie. If Shorty texted me right now and said, "Let me <laughs> suck your weenie," like pulling up the tape or something, I'd walk out on this Wait, podcast. I'm trying to find a Let bug. me see your PP in, in pictures. If a girl right now texts me and said those words, I would suck your weenie. I would walk out on this podcast. I'd go get my weenie sucked too. If so, if a girl if wanted a girl to suck what? weenie, only if they said that though. Let like if a girl was, if a girl texted me, she's like, "Hey Josh, I want to suck your weenie right now." I'd be like, "Guys, I gotta go." Like, oh, I wouldn't be mad if you But if she said, I want to suck your dick right now, I'd be just like, like yeah. crawl, yeah, Just, yeah, just, just like, crawl under the table and left. But, dude, if she said, like, he I want like, to suck your dick, I wouldn't do it. He, skirts by like he's in, we're at the movies. He's like, all right, guys. Uh, 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 all right, I'll gotta, see you guys later. I, gotta, I don't think I've ever, see, I've ever heard a girl say weenie. I've never heard a girl say weenie. Me either, dude. That's what I'm saying. If they did, I'd fucking do it. But, like, if some chick right now was like, yo, Josh, I want to suck your dick, I'd be like, meh. You'd be but like, weenie? Like, you'd be weenie? like, nah, you'd be like uh, I'll hit you up after this podcast. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But if she that. said weenie, you'd fucking throw your headphones down and bounce. Yeah, and y'all would understand. Y'all would be like, all right. Oh, we'd all understand. We'd be like, yeah, you got to go, dude. Or I would text her back and be like, y'all have to suck my friend's weenies, too. <laughs> <laughs> Our weenies. 
Just weenies? come over and suck all our come suck all my friends' weenies. <laughs> Will you please come over and suck all of our weenies? Weenies, sounds bro. Sounds so like childish. Weenies. Just like a weenie in a blanket. Chad says it all the fucking time. Chad does say it all the time. That's, and like that's his, all I can think of. That's his flex. Ah, uh, oh, shit. All right, Silas. You've never been interested in this one time until today. Oh, what was up there? How long oh, yeah, have you been chilling? Whole pod. Whole pod, man. Really? Yeah, like 15 oh, minutes, yeah. Really? I did not notice her one time. That's yeah. for sure why Mimi didn't want to come on the table. Oh, okay. Mm, they makes have sense. ongoing beef. Yeah, they hate each other. They're the, they're the alpha females. Oh, okay. oh yeah, yeah, that that's right. Sense. Yeah. That makes sense. What about Pierre over Mimi's there? A, dude, Mimi scares me sometimes, Pierre's big man. chilling, dude. Pierre got his stitches out today. Do you have so to, like... I, Go I took, under anything or like did they just no, out? So I took Pierre to the vet. His fucking appointment was 1130 this morning. I get there promptly, 1130. I go up. I take him in. I'm like, yo, Pierre, Pierre's here to get his stitches out. And they're like, okay, sit over there. We'll, we'll get you a room. Cool. 30 minutes, I'm sitting in the waiting room. I'm like, the fuck is an appointment for, dude? I don't understand that shit. What's appointment for? I know, right? The appointment is for your time slot to fit you specifically, perfectly. Oh, they never like that. So I'm sitting there. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. We finally make it into the room like 45 minutes later. I get in there. They're like, okay, uh, we need to weigh him. We're going to have to do uh, his temperature, his blood work. And I was like, no, 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 no. I was like, he's here to get his fucking stitches out. And that is it. I'm not trying to have a whole fucking exam so you can charge me fucking 45 bucks or whatever. Right. And they're like, well, we have to make sure that he's healthy. And I was like, look at him. He's fucking running around. He's all good. I was like, please just take his fucking stitches out so I can go home. I have shit to do today. And they got so butthurt about it. But they did it. Dude, that's how it is, though. Like Sometimes I'll go to like, sh- wo- I'll well, go wound care or something, and I'll be like, yo, what's the earliest you can be here? And I'm like, eight, eight, or whatever. You know? And I yeah. get there at fucking five, five, ten minutes early. And I wait till like nine to get it. Finally, get my right. doctor's every time. And so I'm like, might as well just show up. When he got the stitches, they were like, "So when would be a good time for you to get his stitches out?" I was like, "Uh, whenever. I'm free, literally whenever." Right. They're yeah. like, "Okay, Friday, uh, August seventh. What day or uh, what time?" And I was like, "Literally any time of the day doesn't matter." Dude, doctor's office They're should like, do that shit. Like we have eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm like. Any of them doesn't fucking matter. They're like, okay, eleven thirty. I was like, don't Perfect. know why you would pick that one. I said, literally any fucking time matters. Like, does I don't give a shit, bro. I'm just trying to get these fucking stitches out. And yeah, still, it stresses, it stresses me the fuck out. They were out. straight up trying to charge me for an exam today too. I was like, nah, fuck you. Well, it's kind of like taking your car in, like to get your oil changed. Like, well, your brakes are really bad right now, and you know you really need to change out that cable and, and that transmission fluid. Yeah, like, really oh, like, yeah, you're. They, you only, they do that shit hardcore at those machine yeah. shops like Jiffy. And your windshield wipers need to be replaced. Yeah, your, wel- your belt's going. I was going to be about 360 if you want to keep your car in good condition on the road. It's like, dude, just change my fucking oil. <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah, like, yeah, that's like, all What am I coming here for, bro? Never, oil change. <laughs> never send Give your me the fucking fuck out girl, of here. Yeah. Never send your yeah, girl Because they know if shit. you're vulnerable. They don't do it with me as much. They do it with women every fucking but, time, dude. Dude, I fucking... Uh, the funniest story, I fucking went to get my oil change when I had that Pontiac Sunfire when Chris Benson was in town one time. Oh, hell yeah. We went to get my oil change, and uh, the dude came back with all the little fucking <laughs> the little things, you know, like all the little filters and shit. And he was like, hey, so, and I like, I was like, I'm going to stop you right now. I don't give a fuck, dude. I just want my oil change. And he was like, well, and I was like, eh, stop. I don't care. I literally just want to get my oil changed. He was like, well, if you're going to... I was like, you're not understanding me, dude. I don't care. Please just change my oil. And Chris was fucking laughing his ass off. I was like, dude, I came here for a fucking oil change. That's it. I don't give a fuck what you have to say to me. Dude, your fucking bleacher blew slow, bro. I was like, dude, this (laughs) car has fucking 300,000 miles on it. You think I give a fuck what's going to fucking keep it running anymore? No. They'll do that everywhere, dude. (laughs) Discount tire, they'll be like, well, this tire looking looking a little low. It's like, dude, I just came to get my flat That's my favorite machine. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, dude. I'm trying to get that fucking flat thing. I came to get a fucking, you know one of those aroma things that hangs in your car and then they're like trying to sell me a fucking new car or like if I an actual tire. tree i'm trying to get my tires rotated they're like well 
This one is a little Dude, bit low. You actually though. need a new set. This one's fucked. It's dangerous yeah. on the road, man. We can't let you leave. Dude, we should fucking like, test uh, it. Man. You can't let it, me man. leave? Okay. Get my shit down off the lift. And Watch me, the me fuck, leave, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch me leave. It's not safe for you to be on the road. <laughs> Dude, I remember one time when I was in San Diego, I put too much oil in my car. So I was like, oh, fuck. I, I need to drain some. So I took it to this one place across the street. And then they're like, oh, it's going to be $20. And I'm like, to take, so take a little bit of oil out? They're like, anytime we got to lift it, we got we to gotta charge, charge 20 Charge lift, yeah. And then I went across the street. And then I'm like, hey, can you drain a little bit of oil out of my car? He's like, yeah, just pull it in. I'm like, how much is it going to be? He's like, oh, I just got to fucking... And it's nothing, dude. Don't worry about it. And I'm Solid like, hell board. yeah, here's five. Free. And then after they did, I just tipped them five dollars. Yeah, nice. I'm like, wow, they're just trying to get my ass. You ever changed your uh, brake pads without any uh, supervision for the first time before? Back when I was into fucking yeah. race cars and shit, like <clears throat> when I was like into fucking like Mustangs and Camaros and shit, I fucking changed my brake pads, man. Like, you gotta bleed you're that shit. If you don't bleed it, you get stuck. It get it. It not only does it get stuck, like your brakes don't work. Yeah. So I had that fucking like that 300, like 400 horsepower Camaro, and I changed my brakes. And I'm, I was like a 16 year old kid, you know, changed the brakes. I didn't know he had to like pump them up and bleed them out, dude. So like, oh yeah, they weren't. There was no pressure, so I went and fucking drove around the and block, man, and hit the brakes, stop. and that bitch did not stop, dude. <laughs> that sounds. What did you do? Pump your brakes until they got better? Or? Yeah, you just gotta pump them yeah. up, you know, get that brake fluid going in there. Yeah. But, you know, as a 16 year old kid, I you don't think about yeah, shit no like clue, that, yeah. that part of it. You you think if you got it all lined up and it's changed, it's good. But yeah, you just think of the mechanical yeah, part. Yeah, you're like, all right, I did it, and then it's like, yeah. oh, but everything's all good now. Yeah, man, don't don't. That's uh, the only thing I've ever done. I've changed <laughs> my do brakes and I've my changed my rotors and like uh, calipers, but. That's about it. I've never done anything like major. Yeah, the cal- if you take the whole caliper off, you have to take that little... I mean, you know, cars are a lot different now. This is a 1999 Camaro, so it's yeah. got like a line that goes to it that bleeds it right into yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Devin showed me how to change battery the other day. Yeah. Oh, that's a fun game sometimes, yeah. if you have, depending on what kind I of car terrified. you have. I was terrified. Yeah, it's terrifying. You just bro. gotta. You, well, the thing is, you have I to mean, make sure you I'm do sure shit Devin right. I'm sure Devin was terrified because of fucking electricity, but well, I was terrified too. If you switch the positive and negative, and you You're start fucked. your car, it fucks your electronics oh, dude, it up. It fucks the yeah. whole inside of the I've car. Changed the tra- I've, really, I've changed the radiator too. That's a, that, I forgot about that radiator, but. I mean, we got her done. I don't know shit about cars. I've changed. Yeah, I swear, man, we, we got cars done are <laughs> I've changed my tire before when I had a flat. That's about yeah, I've it. I've done that before too. I don't know. That's shit a that's a very too. uh a very good thing to know how to do. A lot of people to change. A lot of people don't know how to bro. even use like a lift for the car. They'll put it on like their oh like a jack, their fucking side skirt or their fender oh, and just rip dude, it off. I've seen it happen so many fucking times, dude. Yeah. Be, oh man. Yeah, Especially, I've seen that. It just like dude. bends their frame or whatever. Oh yeah, where they don't hit they, they, they don't, don't put, put the jack on the frame. frame. Like they, they put it on the plastic part and just like breaks. Oh yeah, that's just. Dude, that shit, you can, dude, I've seen it happen so many times. That's just logic to me, and I, like, I understand some people just have never done anything like that, but it, the first time I changed my tire, I didn't need someone to show me what the fuck to nah, do. yeah. It's I like, just understood the concept, like, take sense, the shit off. Bro, yeah. It is common sense. And then almost. when you're jacking it up, don't fucking put the jack on anything besides something that's solid. Yeah. That's right? metal, or a piece of the frame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. a piece of the frame Straight is steel, obvious. Yeah. The frame. And don't put it on your fucking bumper thinking, oh, this is going to hold me up. Right, a fucking fiberglass, <laughs> it's gonna especially go... in a new car, because all cars nowadays are made out of fucking bullshit. Dude, I've seen, I've seen a, I know a girl that, like, yeah. uh... <laughs> Blew her, like, seized her engine up because, like, her oil her oil light came on and she thought it was just, like, oh, no. her, her windshield wiper or fluid and she her, didn't her know. Fluid. And she kept fucking putting windshield wiper fluid in there and it, the sign wouldn't go off and she didn't know what to do. And oh, my she God. had fucking, and that blown her motor and threw her rod. Se- yeah, seizing it up. Oh, sounds like Derek Carden. Oh, oh, hell. Hell. What'd you do, Derek? What'd you do, Derek Carden? Derek's on Derek Carden. Derek, story. Story. Yeah, Derek, Derek fucking threw a rod in uh, one of his cars when we were like, that little black saying. Honda Civic. Did uh, anybody have like a, a little green truck? Did anybody have like it a? Was the, it was a green truck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Did uh, Steven have one of those and like a Lante or something? He did. Steven had a, a fucking uh, Mitsubishi Galant. Yeah, Galant. A Galant. That's he, what it is. He yeah, wrecked it into a fire hydrant. Yeah, that's when that's, that's when like Revolution days. He did leave it there. Oh, okay, I was I thought I might have got him. That's like Revolution days. Gomez. Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly. Yeah, he allegedly left it there. It's cool, you know. We all allegedly do things. Allegedly, so he, allegedly Steven wrecked his car into a fire hydrant. And allegedly, uh, I took him there the next day, and his car wasn't there. And we worked together at at this time, allegedly. And uh, 
he was like, fuck, what am I going to do? And I asked him about it the other day, allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we know it's allegedly, <laughs> dude. <laughs> <And it> was, <laughs> I guess... I guess his mom actually fucking, like, paid the fine for it. Because I was like, dude, how did you not get in trouble for that shit? He was like, oh, allegedly my mom fucking paid for it. That's so weird, man. I mean, that's like... So wild. Because I remember that night. Yeah, fire hydrants are strong as fuck. Yeah, we were allegedly fucking drinking real hard at Clark's house. Uh, Canadian Miss, Stephen's favorite Mm. whiskey. (laughs) Canadian Miss, Stephen's favorite whiskey. They still make that shit? Hell yeah, they do. Come Don't that, they, Steve? That little skinny plastic I know bottle. You're listening. It's like I know blue. You're yeah, it's Steven. blue. Yeah, blue. Canadian. Has like a little fucking dime oh, on it. Right. What kind of alcohol is it? Canadian whiskey. whiskey. Yeah, it sounds Maybe terrible. Maybe like Seagram oh, 7 with yeah. it. Oh, it's the worst goddamn whiskey, dude. 7 and 7 it's is pretty than good. It's black velvet. Oh, it's goddamn dude, fucking the terrible. Worst, the worst, and I'm going to get a lot of slack for this, but the worst, I think, is, the, is brandy, dude. Brandy is. Oh, I was gonna say, you say Jack. Bro, Daniels. you over here drinking that Presidente every day. Bro, I, 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 you know, I'm not gonna let it, just let it sit there. <laughs> what the fuck's brandy? Pour uh, that shit like, out. What, what's the difference know. between brandy and other shit? Brandy, brandy is just cognac, basically. Cognac, yeah. Cheap, cheap ass cognac. What's the difference between cognac, brandy, and whiskey? Uh, whiskey is just, it's just what, what, what it's thing. made with. Yeah, what it's made oh, with. Okay. How it's distilled. How it's aged. Dude, I was wondering, how much man. of that Presidente you got left? None. You killed it. Killed you it. killed a leader of Presidente. And I killed a handle of fucking Tito's, too. Yeah. Hey, man. You just I, I know you it. fuck with your boy, you too. You can drink any alcohol if you mix that well, shit. Brandy well, brandy is enough. really good. Like, brandy is good warm. Like, it's meant like to drink warm. Right? Nothing's good warm, brandy. dude. Brandy is. Nothing is good warm. Brandy's good. It's better warm than it is cold. You're out of your fucking no, mind. No, I'm telling you, bro. I'm about to throw up just thinking about you throw, anything. You, you, get, you, you get yourself a little a can of soda and then get some warm brandy with some ice cubes in it. It is really good. You know what's good? Not even warm, dude. Room temperature, water. That's it. Nothing's good warm. Bro, whatever. Ramen, bro. mac and cheese, food. Pizza's good warm. Food's good warm. Yeah. Brand, Wait, what, what's the you're, argument you're here? You're telling me brandy's good warm better than cold. It's not like I'm, it's not like I'm sitting there just it's fucking taking a shot warm, of warm brandy right? with no chaser. I'm you're like mm, cold water. You know what sounds good? Warm brandy. No, I'm not, I'm not like that. I'm like, fuck, goddamn fuck, drinking, shit fuck anyway. drinking this <laughs> warm-ass brandy, but I'm, I want to... Catch a buzz, but it, it tastes better warm than cold. Yeah, it's supposed to be drink warm. Well, it's not supposed to be stored in the refrigerator or the freezer. So is whiskey too, it's, but huh. yeah, it's we supposed to be stored Jack warm. I mean, whiskey does have like you get more of the fucking notes. You want it to be warm. Whiskey. The only thing you want to be cold, ice cold, vodka. Room, room temperature, dog. I think you're a fucking weirdo if you like. No, not like yeah, of course not. Whiskey with water. like boiled in the fucking pan, yeah, hot. hot. Like sitting, I mean, I, I, yeah, warm. Sitting warm. at your bar, like, like you know, sitting at the bar, like, you know, a whiskey bar. Mm-hmm. That works with beers, too. Like, some beers, like, if they have really layered fucking flavors and stouts, like, if, oh, yeah. it, if it warms up a little bit, <laughs> yeah. you get all the flavors in it. Yeah, especially there. stouts or, like, a, yeah. Or, like, uh, German, like a flavored German IPA yeah. is, like, you, like, a peach IPA or some shit. You get that peach. I fuck with some peach, bro. Anyway. Yo. Josh. Huh. Let's go ahead and talk about your fucking calling or texting debate. Look, oh, there she yeah. is. She fucking made Yo, it. What up, Mimi? She didn't make it. What's up, Mimi? Finally nice. made it to the pod. Dude, she's like, what? So is this, is this her first time on the pod? Dude, her face Holy just told me. Shit. She was like, yeah. oh, so this yeah, is what you right? right here. None of the cats have ever been down She's here. like, oh, you found out baby. my secret, eh? <laughs> Hi, Mimi. Hey, Mimi. She's figuring out ways to get out of here, man. Yeah, she's trying. I've been hearing her try to open the door and shit. Just get the fuck out, Mimi. Yeah, well, you should never came down here if you're gonna be all a hater about so, it. So you're gonna be a pussy. Uh, for yeah, anyone, my debate. For uh, anyone watching, I have fucking three dogs and two cats. There's one of them. The <laughs> other one you'll never see. He's really, he actually has two he's more really dogs. He's really fucking fat <laughs> and orange. I'm a bulldog. <laughs> what kind of dog would you? Be? Uh, actually, I know we're getting away from my texted call. I'd be like debate, a great Dane. I think. What kind of dog do you think you'd be if you were a dog? I I'd think they would be a fucking Boston. I feel like it'd be one of my like, greyhounds or something. Like, I think I'd be like a great, like a great Dane or something. Yeah. I don't know. Right now, Josh, with your dreadlocks and your cute glasses, you look like. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Tell me, what do you think? I don't know. Those glasses are cute, dude. Are they cute? You look like one, you look like one of those dogs. Accident. These are my gamer glasses. Yeah, I play they're, video they're games cute, man. You look like These you have like, a, actually, like a kinda, bloodhound. They're like making a, you look. Make it look like yeah, you're looking cute, dude. Bro, you you rock glasses well, bro. Always. You look like I really needed the confidence. I don't know, man. All homo. All homo, yeah, of course. But trying, what, what kind of dog would I be? I think you'd be a what dog do that think, has led Jesse? those, like, out, like Stan's dog. dog. Like a bloodhound. 
Hey, them, them droopy ass ears. Oh, yeah. Those are that. expensive. That's a pretty yeah. solid dog. <laughs> yeah. Thick ass Labrador. Have you ever boy. seen one of those in real life? Like, knew anybody that had one? Yeah. Oh, I've okay, okay. Sorry, I was getting it backwards. I mean, not Labrador personally, doodle, but then I, golden doodles too. So I've seen them at fuzzies. Not personally, I've seen like people walking them and shit. Dude, they, they fucking. It, I got it twisted because the lab, you know, poodle, the golden yeah, doodle yeah. too, a golden retriever poodle mix. No, those are sick too. Dude, yeah. They, yeah, they got like that super like curly hair. They got like natural dreadlocks. I don't know. I don't know, man. Those things are just. I don't know why they're two thousand dollars though. That's that's what I'm getting at. They're because they're beasts of dogs. They're like yeah, they're they look smart. like teddy bears. Dude, they are, and like the thing, the people like them a lot too because they they don't shed and shit. I don't understand why French bulldogs are like fucking twenty five hundred dollars when you can buy one of these motherfuckers for all they are are these. <laughs> all they are are these with brindled coats. <laughs> all they are is the all they, all, all it is is the word French in front of them, bro. So I got right. one of them right there. Pierre's brindle is shit, dude. Yeah, I like how the Boston Terrier. The fuck out of his He's balls, the goat, dude. Goat of dogs. Can you believe this little Bro, thing right here has Pierre weighs DNA. 38 pounds. God That's a damn. thick boy. Yeah, that is a thick boy. He's a thick ass He boy, could join dude. the dick boy club dude, for he, sure. <laughs> He's <laughs> like, damn, I know you guys are talking about me. Dude, we are, mm-hmm. man. That little pit bull over there. He's dead. You know, it's crazy Forever to think that, they, that it's not really that much, but like, I always, like, damn, that dog's probably like 20, 30 pounds, and they're like, dude, 10, 15, and I'm like. Yeah. <laughs> like, you know, how much, size is probably like what? 16? 25. 20? I'm not very good at judging weight. I only know how to move it. My cat Noble is like 14 pounds. Really? Yeah, Damn. he's a big old boy, man. Bro, I bet, P- I bet PJ weighs at least fucking 15. Yeah, you P- I think Noble's a little bit smaller than PJ right now. Did well, they shit. check like a dog? I think PJ, Emma weighs PJ, like 60 big pounds. Big ass boy, dude. Yeah, 70. Noble's P- just a little smaller than her now. PJ's been... been yeah, but that's, that's his breed, yeah, though. Dude. That's his breed, though, right? Well, he's, he's not, not thick, like, though. PJ's thick. Yeah, Noble's not thick. He looks like yeah. a LeBron James. Like, he's got a big ass foot, and he's just like leaping around, dunking. Yeah. If if we had like a, a <laughs> he cat, could make it in the league. If we had a cat football league, we need uh, him. PJ would be a fucking D lineman, D- bro, lineman, fucking defensive end or something. <laughs> yeah, he a big boy. I forget my dog. I yeah, my Noble dog. would be a receiver. <laughs> Mad receiver. Yeah, Noble is cut, dude. <laughs> Yeah, and Jenny would be like the fucking bench warmer because she's so fat. She'd no, be like, a, be a, long she'd be like a wide receiver or something. My cat would be a little point guard, man. Long He's snapper. a fucking little fucker. Little fucking wiry. Somewhere you don't have to fucking... I know y'all don't get to see my cat too often, but he, like, he's a weird cat. Yeah, he's I don't. Cool. I haven't seen your cat in a long he's time. Not like, he's not like y'all's cats. What is he just do, inclusive he to just, himself? Yeah, he just no. He, like he's actually more like into everything else, dude. Like he's real needy, dude. Like if you don't fucking, like, he, he only does food. this when when homies come over, dude. Like he does like food too. He's like a dog. He like begs for food, and I'm like, whatever, dude. And I give it to him. But well, when he people grew up come with over, dogs. yeah, he did, which is fucking hilarious. Because you know, I got him and Emma on the exact same day, so like they're yeah, they're so like they're that. like but, dude, the same. He's just so fucking funny, but dude, he'll be so chill all day. And as soon as I got a homie coming over. That motherfucker just starts bitching, just mm. crying, crying nonstop. <laughs> See, my cats just want to go outside. And they don't even get to go all the way outside like Dude. other cats. They just go out on the balcony. Do you think they could go outside? Like, do you think they know that they could go outside? Uh huh. Like they're capable of jumping over that fence and just getting out of, the, getting the fuck out of there. His my cat cats, know yeah, how. they're capable of it, but they don't, they don't do know. It. Yeah, they don't know. Jesse's they cats are so good. They just straight yeah, up go out know. on his little apartment balcony and chill. They do. Yeah. They don't. They don't you know. Could they probably, can you could climb. probably even take them outside, like towards the, like the pool area, and let them run around on grass and Maybe, shit. Maybe, but I'm not. Oh, risk that would. It. That would They'd probably get. Them. They'd probably get too used to if it. They went over there once. That's what happened to Virgil, dude. My brother would let Virgil. They're never the same once they go outside. He never knew anything about the outside world, and then they let him out one time, and every single time you like we wake up or Virgil would just sit at the door crying let me out let me out like you know yeah that's the thing with my like I know if I gave my cats too much freedom right now they're okay with just having that little world of the porch and right. I, if I give them any more I think they're just gonna want more dude, all the it time make, it changes them man oh, they it start does. bitching after that dude my cat always comes back home too with like a fucking, fucking fucked up well, eye or for the most of the time they'll always come home cut. cause they're hungry but I'll yeah, but I wouldn't do it in my apartment complex. No, get, if I had a house, it'd be a lot easier. They get beat up. They get yeah, yeah. Yeah, in your apartment complex, you'd probably get beat up by other cat. Yeah, there's some alpha cats around Dude, there. Dude, my cat, yeah, my cat's got a fucked up eye right now. What are you doing? My, I've spent more like money on my cat, like as far as like vet bills and shit, than my two dogs combined. 
Don't jump that way, please. Well, trying, <laughs> That'd be amazing, though. That'd be great footage she if really, you just, she really just jumped fucking on the fucking good right towards now, the, 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 the She looks like she jumps on the monitor, camera. fucks the webcam uh, up. We just play like that's part of our intro for, from uh, now on. She, we should. She looks like she's on a fucking Pantene or like a fucking Olay. Like, you know, that hair shit. Mimi, she, you're looking good, dude. Yeah, yeah she fucking, does have beautiful hair. Do you feed her eggs? Yeah, you feed her eggs. Or does she just get into crow eggs and eat those? Aren't eggs bad for cats? Like, nah, bro. My brother's part of an egg. My brother used to feed eggs to my his cats. Look at, no, no, look it up. Look, look it up. Short there's, is, a, there's a there's a short ass legs. Yeah, she's, I think the she's a fucking dwarf cat. She's she's fucking three years old, man. She is. Dude, she's crazy. She is. And she and she even looks bigger than she is because of her fucking her, her fur. But really, no. she's tiny. No. Dude, I think egg whites are bad for cats. But you know how shit is, man. You hit, you see it on like a meme no. or something. And it it says no, it isn't. Eggs are considered to be the gold standard in protein for a single food that is closest to being. Nutritionally complete as possible, so the protein amino acids Please is good for out. cats. Do you cook them first? Dude, there's nah, something. Just, there's my, something. my brother would never cook them. Eggs, man. Just put eggs in their dinner. My brother what would just crack an egg about? and just let him lick on it. What the hell? Nothing's up there. The but I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure it's just fine Fucking for a cat to base eat a cooked what? egg as well. You know. Back when I thought I was, gonna, I was cold and was gonna work out, like I scrambled egg or something. Put raw eggs in my little shakes and shit. like the fucking pinata or what? That sounds terrible. Dude, it's fucking... She wants, to, she wants to get up in there. You just have to just no. swallow it. <laughs> I know people that used to eat raw, raw eggs all the time. I think it's just like people do that because it's just so fast. Yeah, it's yeah. like it's like a... Yeah. Like that teen. Yeah. It's kind of like... It's so nasty, though. Like the, I yeah. put a lot less water in my protein shakes just so I can drink it fast. It tastes good, but... You put less water? Yeah. Well, because it, it tastes good, but I just don't want to be sitting there so, drinking so, eight so hours. Yeah, like, like yeah you don't want to, like, so like on it. You want to pound, like, pound it like a shot. <laughs> yeah, I used to hate drinking shakes because it took so fucking long. Yeah, it takes that. forever. So yeah, I just, like, put less water. It. You're just supposed to get it in your body. All That's right, why people go like this. They just they put the little... Texting and calling? Yeah, we, we never got to your fucking topic. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got sidetracked so... I mean, I mean, what do you guys prefer? You got the white calls over there? No, they're right in front of you. I got you, bro. What would you prefer, though, man? Like, would you rather somebody call you or text you? Like, it... Regardless, like if you had to pick one or the other, which one? Would I'll you choose pick? either one. I know, but if you had to just if you had to kill one or fuck one, which one? Which one would it be? No, it's all context though. It it's is, all context it because if someone's just telling me like some basic stuff that they could tell me in text, then that's fine. But if it's exactly. something that takes a lot more than just text. Then yeah, just call if me and let's get the other I way. Like, I yeah, like call if you it's because you can you can especially you if you can't like express what you're trying to say or through a text and then you call me and then you're like up there you want to be real specific about what you're saying so you call me and you tell me exactly what you mean so we save like a lot of time yeah, instead yeah. of texting the context, back and forth. the context definitely changes but i'm just saying like if you're trying to hit your homie up just to simply hang out you don't call yeah you're just like what are you doing you yeah, text exactly, them and then yeah. you wait you wait you let them decide if they want to make an yeah, excuse. Yeah, because that's a thing. I don't want to like annoy you. I don't want to text you and then you don't reply and then I call you. Like that's so that's like needy. Like, well, the first the first example is, I'll, I pulled up to fucking Nick's house and I called Josh to just come pick shit up. But yeah, that was our either way. I would have been like, urgent. yo, what's up, I'll Josh? I would have texted him. Every time. I would have texted him and be that. like, yo, what's up? I want to be like, yo, you want to hang? Hey, hey, bro, you want to hang out today? All right, call me back. Like, yeah. I only call Nick when I get here because he doesn't like people knocking on his door. So I'm just like, hey, where are all y'all? I just sit on the porch every time. Wait. <laughs> Do you? Yeah. Yeah. That's a good move. Josh was on the porch for a while, and then I saw him like my camera going. What time did you end up getting here? I know that camera. Cause I, I got here huh? like 7. What time did you end up getting here? Dot. He got here at like 6.45 oh, okay, or some okay. shit. No, nah, not, that, not that early. I wish. Dang. I was a late bloomer. I, I can already tell. I can already. I know for you, Nick, that you, you just like to text, right? I'm a texter. You don't like to call. I mean, you I mean, call, but I, I like to call. Quit attacking me. Like Fuck you, you were saying, if it's like a very, you can always tell, but it's eighty percent of the a, time you're fucking texting. There's Get appropriate times to text. Like I like. There's one of our friends, Chris Madrid. He will just call you out of the blue. Yeah. Even if he hasn't talked to you in like. Six months, Steven and it's also. like, what the fuck, dude? Steven like, does that sometimes. Steven's a caller too. Steven will do it too. My boy Chad, and Danny just like, bro, at least, at least like text me a little bit. Danny's before, a fucking you know, caller. You know, warm me up. I'm not a fucking. Danny's slut. a caller, yeah. Danny's a caller, dude. And I'm like, just text me. Yeah, if he's like wanting to like wanting to hang out somewhere, Trey, like, call, hey, where you at? Let's go hang out over here. And dude, like my night, like my long. iPhone's <laughs> well over six. Are they fighting? We got the fucking animal planet down here. Silas, leave her fuck alone, dude. They, they don't need you, Lolo. You're Silas, good. go to bed, dude. 
Leave yeah, me rough. alone. Relax, man. <laughs> but yeah, that was my point. We do have Animal Planet. Now. And the thing is, though, I'll be telling Danny, just text me, and he still doesn't do it. So. Yeah, it'll be like, yeah. like our ignore the phone call and just text back, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's, That's the a best solid one. play, too. What's up? Did you call me? <laughs> dude, <laughs> like, I do, and I, don't dude, even, I do don't even wait, lot. though. Don't even wait. Like Immedi- As soon as, as, soon as the phone call is done, just forward you just, it, bro, just dude, forward. immediately reply, hey what's, hey, what's up? Did you call me? <laughs> I mean, after y'all hear So this. he knows you have your phone, and you could have answered. Everybody has their phone. But you're just like, dude. nah. No, dude. everyone has their phone yeah. 24-7, bro. That's yeah. the thing, too. Like, uh, fuck exactly. Dude. I'm going to blow my cover on Unless this shit. Unless you, like, fucking, you're in the bathroom or fucking. In the bathroom. Or like, you're at work doing something. At work and, at work and actually legit busy. Dude, when people yeah. call me when they know I'm at work, that shit pisses oh, me off. Oh, me too, dude. bro. I hear yeah. people call me and be like. Because like, they you, know you always, always say that. Where you at? You know I'm working. Like, what, you, what do you mean where the fuck I'm at? Dude, All my right. mom will call me almost the same time <laughs> during a weekday. And be like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I'm at work. Like, do you, how, you literally call me always while I'm at work during a weekday. I work from eight to five. You know this. It's like <laughs> during what? Monday through Friday. Like, you know this. Regular ass job. Yeah. Regular hours. <laughs> you don't have to guess where I'm at. You can basically assume that I'm at work. Like, it's, it's not a, not a big fucking guess there. Well, dude, like you were saying though, the old, like, what's up? Did you call? <laughs> dude, I fucking, every, I don't know how many times I've used this excuse though, but somebody will call me and it's like, you know, I like you enough to want to give you a little, a little response. So I'll text back, oh, bro, it's, I'm so sorry. I, it's too loud where I'm at right now. What's up? <laughs> that's the good one. Like, yeah, I, bro, I, that, I couldn't I answer my phone. I do that all the time. Yeah, dude, that's good. Hey, sorry, bro. People. I couldn't answer my phone, but what's up? <laughs> oh, that fucking, that stock response where it's like, sorry, can't talk right now. Yeah, and that was good that, too. Dude, I fuck yeah. up my boss does that sometimes, dude. I'm like, hell yeah. I'm glad there's Sorry, somebody out there that now. uses Sorry. this shit. I- on my way. That's the best, man. Yeah, dude. I got that from my boss one time, and I was like, dude, fuck yeah. I was just like so happy that he used that. I feel like disrespected when someone does that to me. Yeah, they're just like, 48. fuck you, dude. It's just like, dude, just fucking make a real text message. Around too. That's another question. Though. Like, why is leaving somebody on red, like, Especially chicks, like when you, they do it. Why the fuck is leaving somebody on red such a fucking flex? It's disrespectful, man. It just shows you that, hey, I read your text. I don't give a fuck to reply. Like, I dictate where gonna, this conversation Well, goes. that kind of sucks, though, it because, like, at, so, at some, at, a, at, like, early stages of talking to a chick, like, it's kind of like she's fucking with you playing a game. Dude, they don't stop talking. Or she could that. just not really, really not like you. So it's like, it could be either one, but you never know unless you're just. You know, slide back in them DMs about 10, 15 more times, you know? It's just like, just I'd keep rather... staying after it, you know what I mean? Next thing you know, you're fucking, you got old lady on your arm. You're at the <laughs> movies. You're making out, you know? Next yeah, thing man, you know, you're man. going back home. She asks you have fucking rubber. Next thing you know, y'all are breaking up because you fucked up. You know what I mean? It's not a big deal, though. <laughs> Because you fucking slide in the next girl's DM (laughs) and you're back in the fucking game, baby. That's what life's about. It's a circle of life, the circle of DMs. You DM her, she denies you, she blocks you. It's game over. You DM another girl, you fucking throw your net. It's a big net that you cast out. Next thing you know, you have three girlfriends. When you started with one that didn't even like you that much. Yeah, you can't get in all that shit. It is fishing. Fishing. Dude, you pass. You cast a big fucking net. So as let me as ask you guys: Do you fucking, when you get a new phone, are you down to have red receipts on at all times? Yes, I have red receipts on. I, 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 no, I, I have red. Never, always take them off. Ha, since red receipts have been a thing, have you always, always been had down? them on? I I put red receipts on just to fucking play the mu- except for when game. I have a girlfriend. I, have I like to play games. Same reason. Like I hate to me say too. that I'm probably maybe Every it's like day. a fucking scumbag, but when I have a girlfriend, no, because. She's always like, you you gotta fucking look at my text. But if I don't have... You gotta it, look around it. If I don't See, have a girlfriend, I... I've, I've never had them, and I, I don't... You I, I mean... You don't ever leave your red receipts on? Like, where they... I've, 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 you a different I've never ever power. had them on since they've been a thing. And it's no, like... I think they no should have never made like, that a thing, I don't, I don't really yeah, give it's a shit. Like, it's powerful. It's I don't really like, give a shit because I respond immediately, no matter what. Yeah, but, I do too. I like having Josh them on. Knows. Josh and I fucking talk back and forth. Like I know if Josh yeah, reads we, something, he's gonna fucking, fucking all he's time. gonna fucking hit me right back. Well, <laughs> it's not as much for the homies. It's more like if you're in the dating game, it's kind of like that flex. It's like like read it and then it respond in like 25 flex, minutes. Though, like- when, when has it become I mean, a, when did it, when did it become a flex? It's a flex it's a game, women, dude. You're playing, girls, dude. You're playing the fucking girls, game. Girls it's plain and it simple. Flex. Whether you fucking want to play or not, whether you're in it or not, 
It's a game. If you want to be successful at dating, you got to <laughs> fuck around. If you fucking respond in two seconds every time she texts you, she's going to be like, fuck this dude. He's a fucking loser. Yeah. Oh, my God. He, he actually likes me? Oh, Vic, fuck. Vicky's <laughs> always had her red receipts on. Yeah. And I never have. They're cold, dude. Those red receipts, man. You can do a lot of work with those. They can break your fucking heart, dog. You're actually, honestly, yeah. You're probably, never bothered yeah, they can, you're probably it's, better it's off It's never been like, ah, oh, shit. Well, so, dude, I never <laughs> really check. If someone's but I guess red, we should. We've been together for almost fucking four years, so I should really check, stress. I check. <laughs> I check, and I'm like, oh, I'll sick. I'll fucking have to do it You read my night. shit? I'd like to go hop in the fucking... No, I'm playing. I mean, I'll see you when she'll read some shit and not respond, but I, I never, like, trip about it. Well, I figure they either got busy or... Like, they I'm might have got busy like, or something. Uh, I mean, I can... Anyone can make up a situation in their head, no matter what. Like, oh, well, if di- well, if I shower, just shower, ah, uh, she's fucking letting the dogs out, ah, uh, doing this. If I'm just bullshitting with someone, well, I don't you care. You can also go the opposite direction. Oh, she's fucking a dude. It's uh, usually what it is. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> wow. Yeah, it could that, be either usually, one. Yeah, not, really. When you're well, like, like, I'm not, not saying I've ever thought that. Well, with, no, I'll just say that. The, yeah, the, from my the human that's imagination what it is. can easily well, fucking go. I, and I think I think it's and a bigger one way's good and one way's know, bad. I, I think it's a I think it's a bigger deal for maybe men because it is because it's like when, don't care. when a girl when, when, girls you, when you when you talk when you, yeah when you talk yeah. to a girl when you yeah. talk to a girl and like you're like they lit can. and I have a crush on her or you like her you want to you want to let her know that what's up so you, you're gonna reply to her or you're gonna fucking hang out with her or whatever and then she's gonna be you know she's gonna it's not it's not that big of a deal to a girl because she's gonna be like well I was busy or I was doing stuff because. That's how the yeah you know I I think it it hurts me it definitely hurts me when I'm replying like quickly or responding and then I get hit with a fucking hey what's up or what are you doing or you know blah blah and it's just red the fucking for like five hours and it's like oh nothing I'm, I'm just chilling <laughs> oh yeah and then it goes back to that point. oh everybody like, has oh, a fucking for five phone. for five hours you couldn't have fucking said that and it's like <laughs> you could just say hey I'm busy right now and I'd be like bet I want to text you or like whenever they're saying some shit you know and they're like. They don't say anything, right? Like they don't say shit, and then out of nowhere they get mad at you. But and I'm it's also like, bitch, too, like you so. could have fucking asked me a question, you know? Like. Let me play both <laughs> sides of the coin. So, from a guy's side of the perspective, you 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 text girl, she doesn't respond forever. I'm this is taking red receipts out of it completely. All right. Text girl, she doesn't respond for a minute. When we were in Oklahoma City, I <laughs> I straight up legitimately forgot my phone in the hotel room when we went to the fucking pool yeah. for hours. Oh, yeah, I forgot y'all did that. I got back to the hotel room. Vicky had texted me, what's up? Didn't double text me, didn't triple text me, nothing. What's up? I, re- I responded back four hours later. I was like, oh, my bad. I was at the pool. That could sound like the most sketchy fucking thing on could. earth. Yeah, it could. But, but that was pool. legitimately what we were doing. Yeah. Me, you, and Jesse were just fucking legit kicking it at the pool. Yeah. But see, if you would have had red so it, receipts on. Yeah, but but look, but, but in your situation, though, yeah, yeah, red, red receipts will will change the whole fucking. Exactly. Well, you would change the whole four, dynamic. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Four hours that's later the, with red. But see, that's you're that's kind of like the game that you're if you're willing to play. But like, it's so sick. if if you texted a girl, any sex girl. And she didn't respond for it for four hours. But it said red? And then, no, oh, a different girl. no, without, red, without receipts, red, receipts. No red receipts. She didn't respond for four hours, and she responds, sorry, I was at the pool. Would you, would you be like, you'd be like, all right. I mean, it's just, know, there, there's, there's, too, it, there's, too much, there's too much wiggle room in that type of shit. See? Had I, had I been talking to this lady, and we established a little crush, or whatever, and she said that, I'd be a little bummed out. But if it was like me just... Hollering at her like maybe once, or we, we we met up one time beforehand, and I say, hey, she here's my number. Wait, what's up? And I'd be like, damn, like she's kind of. See, I, there's I, so many scenarios. It makes yeah, me, it is, makes man. me more interested that she hasn't replied back. There's so many scenarios. There is, yeah. I'm just saying, man. Because like, Vicky didn't give a shit. If if Shorty don't text back in ten minutes, <laughs> she's like, oh, it's all good. <laughs> if Shorty don't like, what? If Shorty don't text back in ten minutes, that girl that's been on the bench, she's about to get that. Hey, how you been text? <laughs> She's about to get back. She's about to be recruited to B uh, A squad, A team. You about to hit up the six man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'd be hitting up the six man. Like, <laughs> six man. Like, I say, like if if fucking shorty shorty over here doesn't reply in ten minutes, girl on the the fucking bench player man, six man, she's getting hit up. She's getting her ten she's day. She's getting that. Hey, how you been? It's been a while. Or hey, what's up? <laughs> like you'll oh you'll never believe this or you know. Uh, uh, hey, how have you been? The classic one. You don't ever throw just like hey. I like, just know I I've been on I mean, I'm I've been on both sides of it. Like 
I've been the fucking dude like, ah, oh, fuck. I don't know. I'm pretty fucking And then, petty, got, so. hit, then got hit back <laughs> with too. the fucking, I was at the I'm pool or some hell, bullshit bro. ass fucking shit. And I was like. Oh, I was in the shower like five hours later. I was sick. And so. Oh, sorry. I'm just seeing this. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, sorry. I was fucking. Like, oh, I bet you are. Oh. I, bet that I was, I was on a run or some fucking dumbass bullshit. Or like, hey, I just forgot to reply. But, ah. bitch, and that's why I, sh- I straight up felt bad when I fucking sent that text. Because I, I was literally just at the fucking pool. I forgot my fucking phone. But the pool, I guess, is a fucking... Well, not, yeah, it's, hard, you know, it's hard to have your phone at the pool. You shouldn't have your phone I mean, now nowadays, you can fucking have your phone at yeah, the pool. Yeah, nowadays, you can drop your shit in the pool and it'll be fine. Not true. Sha- not jump true. in there. Yeah, but I, I don't true. like looking at no, my don't, phone. Not, don't do that. Not true for Josh. Josh had a very bad experience. Don't do that. I like, I like if you're at the lake <laughs> or purpose. something. Uh, long story short, Josh has a fucking one thousand uh, dollar alleged drug mirror. Yeah, phone. I got this badass fucking <laughs> iPhone ten that that doesn't work, and I allegedly do cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> of it. Allegedly, guys. He went allegedly, he went guys. Head allegedly. Uh, we, we're talking about fiction on we, this podcast. We, we, we do it's, not. It's, yeah, it's, I've never actually we done. We do drugs not promote life. that shit. Yeah. I've never done drugs in my life, but uh, I allegedly. We don't even do drink. Coffee. This is fucking apple juice, dude. It really is. That's, it's dude, not alcoholic. White Claw. This coffee. Nice. White Claw is fucking bro. Sprite. We're drinking fucking apple juice. This yeah. shit does taste like fucking Sprite. Lid. Dude, yeah, what? I bet 100%. you eventually oh, they're gonna. Oh, this one. Yeah. You know how like they uh, ban flavored tobacco? They're probably gonna do the same thing. Like, this is With too seltzers. easy to drink. Yeah, they're gonna like it's too easy for kids to Bro, drink. Eventually, like, they're gonna have like meal, good, man. meal fucking pods. Just alcohol. Beep, beep. You spike any drink. That'd yeah, be it'll, be, it will be like oh, oh like, yeah, like some fucking like, meal, like, like, like shooters meal, basically, like, but just like shit. that would be sick. flavored that vodka like meal, date rape <laughs> shit, kind of like some root. fucking. Uh, you spread. buy a fucking twenty four case of waters and you're just like, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> yo, hell yeah, I'm <laughs> down as fuck for like, that. What do you put Please. in old fashions? The uh, little whiskey uh, bitters? and bitters? Yeah, yeah, ice. It'll be just like bitters. Bitters, yeah, yeah, just you drop some bitters, oranges, getting faded, dude. Bitters is just like I mean, homie just has a fucking bitter, like a bitter eyedropper thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bitter's just like the espresso oh, of fucking mm-hmm. whiskey, though, right? It's like, it's like, yeah, it's like concentrate. Yeah, it's like espresso, like some, fu- yeah, yeah, like some straight dabs. It's like forty-three yeah, like percent. Don't put too much in shit. there. I had some at your house. I got allegedly, some allegedly, yeah, allegedly we had, we had Jesse allegedly had some friends over the other a couple weeks ago. <laughs> they were just yeah. taking bitter, bitter Dropping eye drops. In their eyes. Uh, so a really nice home remedy is if you ever have an upset stomach. Two Up drops of bitters and some club soda with some lime. Wait. You That's you bitters, mean, club soda? you have a tummy, a tummy ache? Two drops of bitters, club soda, splash of lime. That'll cure your fucking diarrhea better yeah. than Pepto-Bismol, baby. Yeah, that makes sense, man. Or a piece of Just bread. Just a little no. bit of alcohol, you know? And then that, uh... I mean, I think club soda is like the It's just all the stuff all in all. it. Because bitters is made with a lot of ginger, and ginger is really good for upset Yeah, ginger is ma- amazing, bro. Well, they always tell you, like, ginger, lemon, and some fucking garlic or something. Yeah. For, like, your immune system or some shit. Yeah, garlic, garlic's mad healthy for you. Cloves work really good for toothaches. They ever have that problem. Yeah, they do. But you got to be careful with them. If you put too much clove, if you put too much on there, it'll fucking eat. It'll you, start eating. Just, like, skin. knock out your you tooth fucking, and then stick a clove in there. Like yeah, I remember tooth. when you had that thing, you can put a Josh, fucking, when you put cloves you in your mouth. fucking... Tea oh, bag on love your it. We were in like high school or something. We were Josh, didn't it. you fucking put tea bags on your fucking teeth when they when it was hurting when one I time? Had a toothache, yeah, but it didn't work for me. Tea bags, huh? Yeah, I just had fucking the boys' tea bag. Josh, was, Josh was tea bagging himself. Jesus, yeah. <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with that. Yeah, dude. Nothing Marilyn wrong. Manson could do it. Nothing wrong with a good tea <laughs> I bag. I saw a meme today, and it was it, it's funny you said that shit because it was it was a Marilyn Manson meme, and it was like him like being like a science teacher, and it was like it's like ribs that are unnecessary, and it like had the fucking <laughs> bottom two circled out. Yeah, <laughs> hell yeah, man. I saw a really fucking funny meme. It was uh, Bert and Ernie, and they were looking at a fucking like a board. It was Bert Ernie looking at it, and the board said X on it, and it was all Bert telling. Ernie, who's going to give it to him? <laughs> X going to give it to him. <laughs> Did that have... shit fucking <laughs> cracked me Did up have way DMX too hard. Give to X going to give it to you. To you. Mimi. That's a Mimi, don't please. Give it to you. No. What? No, no, no. Go away, Mimi. Come on. You little <laughs> animal. All right. Uh, <laughs> we've been informed that we're at one hour. Oh. 
It flew by, dude. Really, it did just fly started, by. We just started getting good. We were just talking about random shit. I, uh, it. I would like to shout out Pondicetta Brewing Company for providing us with uh, Vanna White New England Pale Ale uh, made by Sox and Jamie. Oh, wow. And uh, what's the other one? Uh, good, good morning. morning, good morning, San Jacinto Brown Ale, Jesse's favorite. We'll be looking forward to our next Cold Cuts good. collab. You can order these beers at Pontesetta.com, or if you live in the Amarillo area, go to 7500 Southwest 45th Street. Yep. Mm-hmm. Are they uh, dining right now, or this only takeout still? Nah, just just takeout to go service. You pull up, you can order it online. Uh, if you pull up, you can fucking order whatever. Andrew, John, Joe, they're going to take care Monday of you. Monday through Sunday. So, yeah, pull up. Facebook, also, uh, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, every Thursday, they're doing new sangrias. This week, they're doing a coconut mango sangria. So go holler at them if you want to, if you're into some sangria. Yellow City Street Food, thank you guys. Always sponsoring us. I know you didn't provide us some beers, but oh, wow, they're close on you Mondays always now? keep us rolling. They provide us love. 8th Avenue Tattoo. Holler at them. You want, <laughs> you want some great tattoo work? Holler at Jordan or Vincent, man. They're, they're pretty damn good, the I'll best. tell you that much, man. They're the best in the city. Best in the motherfucking West, baby. Who else we got? Anchor? Anchor. Oh, Anchor. voice crack. Anchor. Anchor. Was, that the, was that the first voice crack on the pod? No, you've no, uh, you, you crack all the time. Just bro. me? Wow, dude. Yeah, only you. Only me, huh? I think I've done, I might have done one. He what is, what is the science behind the voice you. crack? Well, I guess we got to do, it we got to run through the whole your, your balls are, are starting to drop. Yeah, I know that, but like, what? Where's the terminology? You have the Anchor app memorized, don't you? Yeah, yeah it's an app. It's good. Uh, That's it. I'm just the Growler Pod is it all brought in, to you by Anchor. Anchor is the easiest way to start podcasting. It's free. They provide all the <laughs> tools to record and edit your podcast directly from your phone or your computer. They distribute it to all platforms Ooh. like Google, Spotify, <sighs> Apple. You know, all the good ones you want to listen to. Uh, Best part about Anchor is you can make money from your podcast with no minimum listenership. So what are you waiting for? Download that free Anchor app dot com or, yeah, blew it. Download that free Anchor app or go to anchor.fm to get started today. Hey, go back to that fucking graph. See, I was fucking that one. I was drunk slurring through that one, dude. But I got it. Though. This this COVID. I got it better than probably the Jesse COVID summer has been tough on us, guys. What the fuck happened? <laughs> People Sorry, started going I'm, outside and stuff, dude. Damn, we some, going down, bro? I'm looking at some numbers right now. Our we're numbers not, going down. <laughs> we're actually worse than what we were when we started. Is that off of all platforms? This is just. When were we peaking? June or May? That we peaked in May twentieth. Okay. What, what? Tell me what this is saying right there. We had 123. We had 120, 137 yeah, dude, plays. Don't put this shit out on the web. Oh shit, my bad. Yeah, don't put this shit out on the airwaves. We're Sorry. fucking killing it, dude. Yeah, Thousand you, views every. All you gotta episode. do is just <laughs> fucking follow us, guys. Come on. I just think it's crazy. We had like a fucking a million views last week and only had Yo, give, us, give us a fuck, this week. Give us a fucking subscription, you know. Yeah, How the fuck are we gonna have yeah, a million? On, views? You like the pod? Tell your friends about it. Please give us a five. Just star, listen. Listen five to you. I'm sure you'll on laugh any at any podcast something. platform you listen to. Those. Ratings go a long way. We really appreciate it. Tell a friend about it, and uh, that's all I got. Follow us on Instagram, yo. Like, give us a YouTube. Yeah, holler YouTube us on like, Instagram at Growler Pod. Subscribe. We're at Growler Pod literally everywhere in the world. Holler at us. Watch, I'm just gonna suck my weenie. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Follow. I was gonna say that, weenie, yeah. that. That's fucking Josh's Instagram handle this week. At suck my weenie. Just that uh, weenie. <laughs> no. At, at suck my weenie. Please see if that's available. Yeah, I I'm doubt it. Be, I was, before was, we get off of here, we have to see if at suck but my weenie. See if there. Yes. Yeah, look at multiple too. options. Yeah. I.e. If S U C K is available, S U K. N E E. N Y. But I, I made it sure. It doesn't Devin. appear as there are any accounts, but you, I don't know. You never know. It's available. <laughs> it sounds like it's available. Dude. Actually, hold on, hold on. Better get out of, after it. You I'm can gonna... find Josh at, at suck my weenie <laughs> on Instagram. <laughs> Yo, dude, dude I wonder if they would let that. <laughs> I bet they would let it. It's like my pee pee. No, I'll let it. Let me change the name. Settings, I think. 
Yeah, but click on the I little the cold cuts. Click on the burger, the little burger menu. Be able to click edit. Click on the burger, like the burger option or the the menu thing. Go to your settings and then click on that little looks three so option old thing. Doing it also with your glasses. And then go to settings. Dude, go to accounts. I'm already there. I just don't. Oh, okay, never mind. See where it's Dude, at. Josh has his glasses on, so he's he's an old man. He can't fucking put them down here. Dude. Yeah, yeah. Put them on your nose. And yeah, you'll there you go. It. That's better if you put them on your nose. I'm like a fucking widowed old lady. I'm about to look. I'm about to look for it right now. Dude, I don't know how to do this. Suck my weenie. Edit profile. There we go. <laughs> Username. I got it. Did it work? Dude, mine, I just changed mine. Yeah, it works. God damn it. Now I can't have it. No, no, you can, have it. you can have it. You can have it. <laughs> Suck my weenie. But it was N it was it was S U K N uh, N E E. S U C K N E E. I changed mine to suck my weenie. <laughs> <laughs> Why the fuck does everybody else get to be it? <laughs> like, like the full, whole full on spelled out. I changed this shit to suck my weenie. <laughs> I changed mine to suck. All right, I guess that's fucking time for See, us to get out of here. The username isn't available. Please try another. It's not available because, because it. Jesse <laughs> fucking so never took it. I scooped it up because you're taking too long. So. <laughs> Is it, it's not your actual handle, though, is what I'm saying. Oh, is it not? You, yeah, you can change your name to anything. Oh, I'm talking okay. about it. It's username. Though. Did username have suck my weenie? Or is that yeah, what you probably that? can't say suck or weenie. You, I mean, obviously weenie. you can. Oh, god damn it, you're right. <laughs> suck All right. my pet curve. <laughs> <laughs> Pecker, we gotta get the dude. Fuck that one's here. also taken. What about what about Pecker Peeker, bro? <laughs> Pecker Peeker. Oh, if Josh was at Pecker Peeker, I'd lose my shit. <laughs> <laughs> if Me- it was like at Pecker Peeker, like your photo. Meet Gazer 420. <laughs> <laughs> what did you Woo! say? Meet Gazer, huh? What did you say about that, dude? What if Pecker Peeker was available? All right.